Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, Microsoft at Ignite showed different uh, new uh, technologies used to increase security within Windows environment. And one of them is going to be very, very good um, and it has to do with what we call a category of malware that's called scareware. And you've possibly came across this, especially when you go to you know shady websites uh, there are quite a few that uh, have these popping up, and uh, it has to do with you know fake messages that appear in your browser, and that look something like this, um, you know errors. It looks like a real scan. It looks like a real software. It gives phone numbers uh, to call to help and download the software. So they tell you you know you can click activate a license and so on, and you know the way they do it. It really looks like a real scan, but in reality, it's not doing anything. And it will tell you that there's errors and so on. And these are really scareware. They're trying to scare you into all sorts of things. It could be another type of scareware, like the ones for telling you you've done, you know, you've done some bad things on your PC, and now that the FBI knows about it, and that you can pay a fee and so on. Well, these will, uh, in uh, the future from now on, not really uh, either not appear at all in your browser. So if you go into one that's supposed to pop up, it'll be blocked because it will recognize what it is. Uh, if it is borderline, uh, it will show up, but there will be a pop-up or a message from the browser saying, no, this is fake. You should probably not download this at all. And um, there will also be now in the Windows Defender app a, a new uh, way of scanning that actually, if it sees that you're trying to um, get into, you know, the um, install one of those cleaners, if you want, it will immediately block the install. And if you have successfully installed one, it will actually remove it as it will have a list of complete um, tools like those that are supposed to help, but that are, in reality, malware disguised uh, as something that looks like it wants to help you. So there will be an increase in that security side, which is really good. Uh, honestly, I think it's uh, you got to be you know more and more careful, but if you can have help from any software to uh, prevent these, um, of course, it's always welcome. Of course, like I always say it, the first security is you, what you do. So don't click any of those crappy software. There are no tools you need in Windows. It is untrue. Uh, just keep Windows the way it is. Don't start downloading a million tools. It never helps. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.